Now to the top story tonight, reaction. Joining us from West Palm Beach, Florida, Laura Ingram. All right. Now, you do a radio talk show that's kind of conservative, and uh, Monica Crowley does the same. She'll be coming up behind you. What do you think about all this? Well, uh, number one, I, I would I would say, Bill, there, there is a feud. I mean, uh, I think... Uh, Think about you and Limbaugh. I mean, both of you are friends of mine, so uh, I, I, I'm in this position where I think I think when you said they have to do more than Bible thump, I don't think you really needed to say that, right? Well, I think you could say number one. Number no, one. Not, no, wait, 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 wait. Let me, No, no, no. We're going to get very specific, as I told you. Yeah, before I am going to get specific. Here. If you let me talk, I will get specific. Well, Can you, I finish my sentence? No, because you made may, two may statements I? that are fallacious, and I'm going to correct them. There's no feud between me and Limbaugh. I don't talk to Limbaugh. I've never said anything about Limbaugh on this program. I'm so talking about the he, feud about the issue. There's no, the issue. There's no feud on my part. I don't care what okay, he says. I'll, he can say me, whatever let me, he wants. Let me finish. Okay, no, let no, me, no, let no. me finish. I, and I'm, thump I, the I'd Bible. Like both of you, let me. Thump the okay. Bible. Listen, you're going to look. I'll give you your time. You just keep it I, I adore you. I'm just accurate. trying to make a point. All right. And I'll let okay. you make the I, point. I haven't said anything yet. The Go thump ahead. the Bible deal was purely a policy play. Go. I don't think you need to use the word thump the Bible. No. I think this this debate about marriage, whether you, you have to do more than thump the Bible. Okay, Bill, I think this debate about marriage is a relatively recent one. Supreme Court justices, both appointed by Republicans and Democrats, made that comment during the Prop 8 hearings last week, right? So I think the people who refer to traditional marriage, this is new to them. And I think you're right. They haven't been very good at PR. They haven't been very good sometimes at making their argument. And you're right. I believe that a lot of them do have a very deeply held religious belief about what traditional marriage is. You're a Roman Catholic. I know I am too, right? We, we believe people should be treated with respect. I certainly believe people should be treated with tolerance. There should be a meaningful debate on this. I also think you are correct, and you have been very consistent over the years in your statement about what judges should and should not do. Judges should not legislate from the bench, and you've been extremely consistent with that. Now, I think the left loves to see conservatives fighting about this or that issue. But there You're totally right. They're fighting. exploiting this. There they isn't always any have All right. Now, you had your say. That was a good two minutes. All right. Number one, there's no feud because I don't participate in the feud. All right. I'm not fighting with right. anybody. All I'm doing I'm is pointing about conservatives out. I'm pointing it out. Hashing it out. I'm pointing out the unfair attacks that are coming from both left and the right, okay? I made a very, very honest point, and you just see it, it was the correct point, that if you're going to stand up for heterosexual marriage and exclude gay marriage, if you're going to do that, you've got to do it outside the Bible. You can't cite the Bible because you'll lose if you do right, it. But, Bill, no. Bill just in, in, in response to that, when you say you can't cite the Bible, well, Again, I think that's disrespectful to people who uh, really try to live their lives according to the Bible. It's not disrespectful. I'm not saying everybody... In their private life, they can. We're talking a policy deal here. Don't you understand what? the difference I, between well, private beliefs I guess and public policy? I guess I'm not very well educated. I don't I understand. I guess you don't Bill, understand I'm, I'm, you've I'm, I'm, I'm making... Bill, I'm making... A, I'm trying to make a point There's here. There's no insult that, at all to any Christian belief system I in that comment. I don't think that's what you intended to... I didn't, I didn't say I don't it think, was, there was no insult. It wasn't a matter of I'm intention. Not, it was Bill, seized I'm by not, people. Bill, I, I am trying to make a point to you that if people take that the wrong way, if they jump on that point, yes. all I can say is I say things all the time. I, I talk for three hours a day. I'm sure I could go back and say, oh, I might not have said it you that are, way. Laura, people I'm understand what my point I am is. Do you ever say anything in you tonight? Because okay. you are still, after all of this time, not delineating, not delineating, yes. you are still saying that I insulted Christians who believe in the no, Bible. I, said, I did not. Bill, I was talking Bill, purely did, about Why did policy. you use the word thump? Because that is the way you thump. get it across. There are Bible thumpers, and all they do is say, I object to gay marriage because God objects to it. You don't win a policy debate in America well, with I, that. I'm actually not. I'm actually not, I'm not doing that, and most of the people I know who have gay friends, gay family members, as I do, I, I don't simply do that, and I, I, don't, I don't, this isn't did. really my issue, but, you didn't, I, but you this isn't really my issue, and not, not your issue, you, you said that before, it's not your really issue, you don't focus on it. You are criticizing yeah. me tacitly for using the word thump the Bible. 
which was an I, accurate I don't description think it helps. of what people... You, my, doesn't, I'm not Bill, in business Bill, to what? help. I'm in business Bill, to get um, things done. If you right. want to win the debate... Do you think debate, it was helpful to say that? Helpful? It was accurate and honest. You will lose the debate if that's all you do. You can't I, win I it. Think, I, I think that for some people it's not about winning a debate, right? It's about actually living the life that they want uh, to live for themselves, right, their well, communities, their families. That's fine. And it's not, I'm, I'm not saying you're out there trying to insult all right, people. Right. All I'm trying to say is that some people took offense, obviously, and maybe it's just, you know, a good thing to talk about it. Keep talking about it. It's not I, a bad I, listen, thing. I've got Carly and Cohen to talk me. about it. I'm not mad at you. I'm frustrated because you of all of the radio, and I'm going to say this, Lord, don't listen. Okay. Don't listen. Of all the conservative radio talk show hosts, you have the most common sense of all of them. Okay, yeah, now you they're all bought into them. this garbage, and I'm disappointed. I didn't buy into it. Yes, you did. You asked me to talk about Bible, you your, your into comment it, and I'm about disappointed. if you've got to do more than Bible something, Bill, and all I'm saying is give it some time to percolate. People will come up with better arguments. Look, I don't You're have right, time to, to percolate. I don't have time to do any of that. What I'm doing is doing honest commentary. The polls have turned around think, because one side has a stronger civil argument than the other. That's the truth. I, I think that's right. You and Russia do a tour. It should be called Bigger Better, and you guys should get a tour together and just do it across uh, the country. I'm not going to mention anything great. about anything because I'm not feuding.